Hello everyone, it's Jusil here, sort of binge watching and reacting to Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. This will be episode, uh, I think, 39. 39, yes. <laughs> I never really keep the, the, the count because I'm just, I'm binge watching some of them. If I feel up to it, I just try and watch at least two, three episodes back to back. And then, just so you know, at this point uh, that they am watching this, I haven't yet started to upload the reactions, so I have no idea the pace I'm going at. It's just like with Attack on Titan, even though Attack on Titan, I managed to binge watch the whole thing in five days. This is taking longer just because I'm really not in the mood to sit down and, and watch stuff or I'm not feeling well. It's just that it's a bit annoying because I want to, because I'm loving this, but it's taking me longer. Uh, so it's obviously gonna take longer to upload as well, but I hope the pace is decent. Um, sorry if it's not, but uh, it is what it is. I never intended to keep a schedule with this channel because I don't really, um, well, I don't monetize the videos, I don't uh, have any other, I don't know, attachment to it. It's just, I just see it as a hobby because I love reacting to stuff. Uh, but still, I hope it's not taking me too long to edit and upload. Uh, we are in this place called Basco with um, with everybody in the mount that was in the, you know, in, um, in Briggs, uh, including Kimberly. <laughs> But now we met up with Scar and uh, May and uh, Dr. Marco and the other guy <laughs> that I will never, ever, ever remember the name of, but I don't care. Even though we kind of have a, had a mini backstory of him meeting the Elric brothers in the last episode. Nobody cared. <laughs> Ki Kito? Kino? Can't remember. Anyway. And um, so it looks like now uh, they were about to capture Scar. Uh, but Scar got Winry a uh, hostage and he's getting away. That's not, I mean, that is, uh, they're actually in cahoots, uh, Edward and him, I'm sure. Edward and, I mean, everybody and him. Uh, so the two groups uh, are now working together because, yeah, because we're, they're working against Kimberly, obviously, as you would. And But that's what Kimberly is seeing. So there is a Scar on the roof with Winry and Ed is running away saying, why the hell did you not guard her? Mm -hmm. Yeah, right. And in the meantime, uh, there is some people that got, that have gone to Briggs um, and uh, Olivia is uh, likely going to have to either fight them or, I'm not sure, deal with them in some way. And uh, back in Central, <laughs> there is Pride that is uh, um, keeping an eye on uh, Riza, sadly. And so she can't really communicate with uh, with Roy at the moment. So huh, that's uh, that's a bit of a pickle. But okay, I really want to see what happens in this episode. So without further ado, let's do this. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Looking so menacing. Of course he does. He was having the time of his life. He doesn't give a shit. <laughs> oh, oh, he got away. Ah, suck it. So yeah, they're all in on this. <laughs> Never. Oh, oh, they're so cute. But for now, let's work together. Heh. But I mean, your way isn't really great either. Hmm. Oh, and the two chimeras are just out. Can he even read it? I mean, they're assuming. Yeah, sure, I'll trust your word on that. So we need all the help we can get. Are you sure it's gonna work? It should work. 
work, I hope. If Kimberly doesn't smell anything. <laughs> yeah, everybody had. Al. <laughs> this is a lot of time that's passing, but uh... oh, he's being useful. As, unless they just rip the notebook apart like they did with the letter. Is it her idea? I mean, she's the safest with him, because he would protect her to make amends. Yes. Yeah, if that wasn't enough. Haha. <laughs> Oh, but at least they can go back. I didn't realize that. And the clothes, the clothes come back to. Oh, are they not gonna find them on him? She is. Don't don't even pull this shit on me. Uh, hide them, babe. Oh shit. And there's stuff going on in Briggs, though, even if they get there. <laughs> oh, that could be interesting for the for the feeling that may get from the underground. Yeah, there's that too. Ah, damn it. Oh, and who is there? Beach. Ah, of course. All alone? But... They're just gonna let him out? What about Kimberly? Please don't lose the map. Why? What? What? Why is this happening? No! Ah, please! What are those dolls? Oh! What is this bitch doing in the meantime? W were those the, um, the sacrifices? So isn't um, Roy one? Because they, they still think Marco is dead? I think? I'm not sure. Oh my goodness. Oh, but, the, oh, but how? What happened to Al? 
Why? Okay, so that that didn't didn't give the feeling of the body that uh, Ed saw because I don't know it looked more evil. I don't know if that's just me uh, oversimplifying things, but so pulling on his soul because he's trying to get it back from where he is, if that's really what he saw. But obviously that would it would help as in it would reunite the body and the soul but then he still has to get out of there if that's what's happening if not he's just gonna pull out our soul and then where is that gonna go i don't know but no i'm so ah, why is he alone and how did he slip away like he's not exactly small he just got out in this well nah. oh and and uh, there is um okay someone from central is in briggs right now and armstrong is on her way to central which I guess she could meet up with, well, only with Roy, really, because Riza is being, uh, being, well, being monitored by, uh, by Pride. Ah, my goodness. Okay, okay. I'm gonna take a little break and then I'm gonna keep watching because this is so, so, so interesting now. And I think next episode is gonna be, well, on Netflix at least, the first episode of part four. So only two parts left, not many episodes. And then I'm gonna start uploading. <laughs> Because like I said, I haven't started yet. But okay, I hope you enjoyed my reaction and I will see you for the next episode. Bye!